Hey folks, welcome back into Rio Tinto Stadium for the first time in the new year. I'm Matt Gashk and this is your RSL Rundown as Real Salt Lake prepares to face Toronto FC in the first match of 2017. Number one, youth movement. The veteran core of Real Salt Lake that we've all grown to know and love over the past several years is still intact. However, it is now being peppered with young players from around the globe who will be expected to make big impacts in 2017. Whether it's homegrown product Jordan Allen in an increased role, Joao Plata with higher expectations, or newly signed playmaker Albert Rushnak, the 25 and under crew will be called upon in big ways this year. Number two, Beasts of the East. With high profile stars Sebastian Juvinko, Michael Bradley, and Josie Altidore, Toronto has as talented a group of designated players as anyone in the league. Add in a strong supporting cast, and it's no wonder they represented the Eastern Conference in MLS Cup last year. After falling in penalties in the final, TFC is hungry for more in 2017, but will they suffer the same fate as the last two MLS Cup losers, who both lost the season opener the following year? Number three, Riot Squad. Since Rio Tinto Stadium was opened in 2008, Real Salt Lake is unbeaten in home openers at the Riot. That 4-0-4 record and seven-game home winning streak against Toronto will be on the line with a typically raucous crowd expected to bring the home field advantage that has helped make Rio Tinto Stadium a fortress since it's first opened its gates. Tickets are still available. Join in the fun. After all, it's always sunny at the Riot. 